is Ariel Tustin, and I'm a junior from Lincoln Southwest. That's T. And my poem is called Broken Record. I also want to give a trigger warning for self-harm and violence. I've been having this dream, and every night it repeats like a broken record. It starts out with my roommate cutting her wrists. I'm so startled at the sight that I must intervene and get the knife from her. But her fist grasped, grasped her on the handle, so I had to take it by the blade. The record player skips and jumps. We're both sitting on the bathroom floor, crying confused tears that sear down our cheeks. We're happy that nothing else happened, hysterical about the blood on our hands, and hyperventilating about the horror this memory will have in the morning. The record player stops for a moment. I hear her stifled sniffles in her room. She's crying herself to sleep again like a babe with no mother to hold her. Going to comfort her, I see her phone for one second, and it all makes sense. The record player clicks back into place. She was reading abusive texts from her beloved. She calls out to me like a clueless child and says, I love him because he's honest about what's wrong with me. My rage only builds within me, but I go silent before the storm. And during this quiet night, I hear his dark voice staining her mind with lies about herself, and she believes them. I wait at the door like a beast in the night, ready to pounce at any moment, because inside her room it sounds like torture as he yells at her for crying. But I dare not intervene. Because if I wound him, she will bleed too. Ominous audio comes from the record player. My vision is clouded and I don't know what to do. But then I see his face for one moment and it all becomes clear. He sees the glint of my eyes in the darkness, but he doesn't know yet. He doesn't feel the fear. He doesn't stop when he hears my thundering approach until he feels the shock of my gun against his forehead. The music screeches to a stop. He turns stone cold and mirrors how I feel. I'm afraid like a kid who's never heard a firework. I'm afraid like a ship that's about to sink. But mostly I'm afraid like someone who's lost their best friend. But I push all these fears away and pull the trigger to save my friend from death. And like every other night, the record player stops and starts over. Oh.